When we last left this story, the Grinch found his heart, and Whoville Christmas cheer was miles off the chart. But then a sound sounded that wasn't who singing. Do you ever just wake up and decide to ruin a childhood classic? Yeah, you may want to sit down for this one. How the Grinch Stole Christmas is one of the most well-known works from legendary children's author Dr. Seuss. This is a timeless tale, published in the 50s, but still relevant today as a wholesome holiday tradition. Well, there's a new Walmart commercial in town that acts as a direct sequel to the original story. It also has a serious problem. In this new promo, titled Welcome to the Grinch's Walmart, we see a flashback to Whoville Christmas cheer where everyone's smiling despite their not ideal circumstances. The Grinch's thoughts are interrupted by trucks delivering and doorbells ringing. He decides to start stealing these Walmart packages for some extra loot, eventually loving all the toys and gadgets and gizmos. Yay! He decides to return the packages with the residents of Whoville having the best Christmas ever. I love Smebulock. I love capitalism. Now before I rip this thing to shreds, let me say something positive. I think the animation is beautiful. Produced by Passion Pictures, they did a phenomenal job recreating the homemade feel of that animated special from Chuck Jones. When we're talking about animation alone, this nails the original style almost perfectly. But that's where my praise ends. You see, this Walmart commercial goes against basically everything Dr. Seuss's story stood for. Back then, the Grinch decided to ruin Christmas by stealing what made the holiday so special. He was excited to see the sadness on people's faces the next morning, but was surprised when they instead surrounded each other with smiles. They didn't need presents or anything material to have a good time. They had each other, and that was enough. Extremely corny, I know, but pretty wholesome either way. On that day, the Grinch learned a lesson. Maybe Christmas, he thought doesn't come from a store? Maybe Christmas doesn't come from a store, huh? Oof. Walmart delivery trucks invading the town. A sleigh made of literal Walmart packages. Happiness from the gifts that you can buy, but only if you head to your local Walmart. Ladies and gentlemen, capitalism. What was once a heartfelt message about appreciating the small joys of life has now become, give us money and you'll be happy. And that's really sad. Granted, this isn't the first time the Grinch sold out. There was a whole Hallmark thing in the 90s, but that was no Nowhere near as much of a punch to the face as Walmart. The only way this commercial can get worse is by replacing all the logos with Amazon. No, please don't get any ideas. But at the end of the day, let's all just listen to the original Grinch story and nothing else. While this is fun to watch and I love the animation, it just feels like an insult to the Dr. Seuss classic. I'm not mad, just disappointed. But anyway, that's all for this video. Subscribe for more awesome cartoon videos. Give a thumbs up and comment below to let me know what you think. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time.